In this tutorial, we will make a parametric accent panel pattern design. Let's start. Go to File, New Family. Go to Metric and select Metric Generic Pattern Base. <coughs> Open. Okay. Type UN, change the unit to meters, change to two decimal places. Okay. Okay. Select the grid, change the grid to one meter, one meter horizontal and vertical spacing. Let's change the scale. Okay, next we create reference point, select and select draw on work plane, then set work plane, set work plane and pick reference point, set work plane set and pick reference point set work plane then set pick reference point set work plane and set the work plane pick reference point cancel the command select all Go to filter. <coughs> Check none. Select the reference point. Apply. Okay. Next, go to offset. Pick the button. Let's create a new parameter. Type thickness okay okay next go to family types let's change the thickness to point uh, to point seven apply okay Next, select two reference points, spline two points, check reference line, select the two reference points, spline two points, check reference line. Select two reference point, spline through points, then check reference line. Okay, last select two reference point, <coughs> spline through points, then check reference line. Next, select reference point, select draw on face, pick at midpoint of reference line, pick at midpoint at, of reference line, pick at midpoint of reference line, pick at midpoint of reference line, pick at midpoint. Pick at midpoint, select reference line again. Pick at midpoint of reference line. Pick at midpoint of reference line. Next, select two reference line. Select. 
Okay, then spline through points. Okay. Select select reference point then is flying through points check reference line okay select the two reference point it's flying through points check reference line select reference point line through points check reference line okay same down select two reference point line through point check reference line select two reference point line through points then check reference line okay select again the two reference point spline through points check reference line last select the two reference point spline through points okay check reference line okay Next, we insert the four point adaptive circle. Okay, uh, let's go back. Let's see the go to profiles. We, I have here the adaptive four point circle. Okay, we need to select four reference point okay one two three four adaptive points to make a circle let's load it into the project family two okay okay we need to select four points one two three four so we, we select four reference point okay so let's go back insert the the family okay I'll cancel insert pick reference point one Reference point two, three, and four. Okay. Next, let's try. Okay. Let's flex the family. So, okay. Very good. Let's add reference point at the midpoint of reference line okay one two pick at midpoint okay three and four one two three and four okay okay test okay good Okay. Okay. Next, we insert the adaptive four point circle. We need to pick four reference points. One, two, three, and reference point at the midpoint of the reference line. Okay. One. Two, three, and four. Okay, one, 
two, three, and four. Okay. One, two. Okay, select a reference point. Okay. Can cancel. Let's delete the circle. Oh, exit. No. Okay, select again to delete. Select, delete. Okay. Insert again. The adaptive four point circle. One. Two. So snap into reference point. Three. And four. Okay. Select again. One. Two. Three. Four. Select again. One. Two. Three. And four. Select. One more. Select. Reference point. One. Two. Three. And four. Okay. You need to select four reference point. One. Two. Three. And four. Okay. You're almost there. So now select the profile. The top and the bottom. Oops. Cancel. Close. Okay. Let's select again. One. And the low. Okay. At the, okay. Two. Then create form. Okay. Okay. Let's select the profile again. The circle. One. Two. Create form. Okay. Select again. Select. Two profile. Create form. Select. The two profile. The top and bottom. Create profile. Create form. Okay. Select the two profile. Create form. Okay. Finish. Now, let's try change the thickness to 0 0.05 apply ok, good let's flex the the model ok, ok, good ok ok let's try on the other side ok Next, let's save the family. Let's save it to the desktop. Let's type uh, accent design. Okay, so save. Okay, and then load it into the project and close. Okay, next let's go to 3D. We create a, a surface. Go to massing, in place mass. Okay, okay. Just select a line so it's only a surface. Select a line, any length you want, select. Then select the line, create form. Select the top segment, uh, move up, okay. Then select the, the surface, divide surface. Uh, let's decrease the number of the U grid and the B grid to 6 and 6, okay. Now let's apply the pattern. 
the accent design okay there select okay good now you have the finished accent design thank you